What's up guys, Ryan here from Indie Wrestling School and today it looks a little different because today is show day. I'm gonna walk you through a basic every day in the life of a pro wrestling promoter coming up. I'm on my way to the venue now. Of course, I have a couple things I need to do ahead of time. Um, so I'm just gonna take you guys along and, and show you what the, the basic everyday show for a wrestling promoter could look like. So I'm sitting here in my garage. It's actually several months after I started this video and I'm starting to put it together and I realized I didn't have a lot of footage from this particular event. And that's because we had a catastrophic issue. So basically, uh, on a typical day, I'll meet up with, with the crew um, and I did film some footage of that. 7.30. Take a while. Do it too close. Taking the videos. Jay, do something sexy. Do you that? Scale it back, buddy. Scale it back. All right, so I met up with everybody, kind of went over the show expectations of certain people and what I need filmed from some people. Um, so everybody's on the same page. We, we all ate lunch, uh, so now it's kind of off to the arena and it's wrestling day. Afterwards, I'll head to the venue and start putting stuff together. Start setting the things up that need to be set up. And we usually have some pre-tapes and stuff like that. Burn. That title. Around that time, I got a call from the ring crew saying they weren't going to make it. And I actually thought ahead and, and was filming some stuff on my drive to the U-Haul place to rent a U-Haul to go pick up the ring to get it to the venue. Long story short, we start setting up cameras. I got a text from the ring crew um, that they're going to be delayed a little bit. And then all of a sudden there is an issue with their truck. Um, so I asked them if they needed me to get a U-Haul or what the case was. And uh, they told me, no, don't worry about it, we'll, we'll find something. And uh, an hour later, they said that they couldn't find anything. So I should have just gotten the U-Haul like I originally planned. So we got a U-Haul with a trailer hitch to attach to their trailer. And now one of my guys is headed up there to attach our truck with their trailer. Hopefully it works out. Um, and, and that's kind of the, the theme of running a show is if there's a chance to keep doing it, Make sure the show happens. Um, it is three o'clock, the show is happening at 7.30, so we have a long way to go before we're, we're ready to go, so we'll see. So now the ring gets there, and we have a couple members of the crew, which normally will take them about an hour to set up the ring. We got it set up in about 10 minutes because everybody pitched in. I'm talking about veterans, new guys. Everybody stepped up and got the ring up to get the job done, to get the show done, and to make the people who were there happy that they came to see the show. Uh, Rick just got here, so we're gonna grab everybody and start setting everything up. I didn't mention that we also have pre-tapes that we were gonna do, uh, so we're trying to do that also. <laughs> Every once in a while. Hey, I'm getting a lot of pictures of Ricky standing around. This is great. <laughs> so after we got everything put together, we did the match that we needed to do before the fans got there. I got a good feeling. Yeah, he won the turkey first. Shane Douglas, our 2018 turkey. We finished all our pre tapes. <laughs> Anything can go wrong on any given night when you're running a wrestling show. There's a mountain of issues that could pop up. And when those things happened, I, I mean, you can roll over and die or you could keep pushing forward and do everything you possibly can to make the show happen. And that's what we did on this night. When it's all said and done, the next day you can say, oh, I wish we didn't do this, or I wish we did this better, or I wish we didn't do this. Or you can say, but it all worked out in the end. And I can tell you, at least on this night, but it all worked out. <laughs> Thank you guys for checking out this video. If you liked it, beat the shit out of the like button, and I'll see you next week for 3 Minute Thursday.